Ever wondered what it's like to explore Rio de Janeiro, the city of samba, sunshine, and scenic beauty? Welcome to a place where the rhythm of life dances to the beat of samba drums, where the sun shines brightly, casting a golden glow on the city's spectacular landscapes. Rio de Janeiro, Brazil's vibrant city, nestled between the stunning Atlantic Ocean and lush green mountains, is a feast for your senses. The city is a confluence of history and culture, a melting pot of traditions and modernity. From the lively beats of the carnival, to the tranquil beaches, and the majestic Christ the Redeemer, Rio de Janeiro is a city that celebrates diversity and unity in equal measure. Its rich history is etched in the city's architecture, its diverse culture reflected in its people and their zest for life. So buckle up as we take you on a virtual tour of this incredible city. Standing tall on the Corcovado mountain, Christ the Redeemer embraces Rio with open arms. A sentinel of stone, Christ the Redeemer, is a testament to the deep-rooted faith and architectural prowess of Brazil. This colossal statue, constructed entirely of soapstone and reinforced concrete, has been gazing over Rio de Janeiro since its completion in 1931. The brainchild of engineer Hitor da Silva Costa and sculptor Paul Landowski, this Art Deco masterpiece stands at a staggering height of 38 meters, its outstretched arms spanning 28 meters in a welcoming embrace. The history of Christ the Redeemer is as captivating as the monument itself. The idea was first proposed in the mid-19th century, but it took more than half a century for the vision to become a reality. The construction, funded by the Catholic community of Brazil, took nine long years to complete, a testament to the resilience and dedication of those who brought this marvel to life. But Christ the Redeemer is more than just an architectural marvel. It is a symbol of Brazilian Christianity a beacon of faith that shines brightly against the backdrop of Rio's vibrant culture. It is a place of pilgrimage for the devout, a place of solace for the weary, and a place of awe for the curious. And then, there are the views. From the top of Corcovado Mountain, Christ the Redeemer offers breathtaking vistas of Rio de Janeiro. The city sprawls out beneath you, a tapestry of shimmering beaches, verdant hills, and bustling streets all framed by the azure waters of the Atlantic Ocean. From this vantage point, one can truly appreciate the splendor and vibrancy of Rio, a city that pulses with life and dances to the rhythm of samba. As the day wanes, the statue is bathed in the warm hues of the setting sun, and as night falls, it becomes a beacon of light, a guiding star watching over the city that never sleeps. This iconic landmark, a symbol of Brazilian Christianity, offers an unmatched panoramic view of Rio. From the heights of Corcovado, we descend to the lively shores of Copacabana Beach. This four-kilometer stretch of golden sand, flanked by the shimmering Atlantic Ocean on one side and a backdrop of towering skyscrapers on the other, is the beating heart of Rio's social scene. Here, the city's rhythm is set to the tempo of samba beats and the splash of sea waves. Copacabana is more than just a beach. It's a microcosm of Brazilian culture. As the sun rises, the beach transforms into a living tapestry of locals and tourists alike. You'll find families setting up for a day at the beach, vendors selling everything from fresh coconuts to intricate handicrafts, and athletes showcasing their skills in games of beach soccer and volleyball. As the day progresses, the energy on the beach only grows, with the vibrant sounds of live music and laughter filling the air. Beachfront bars serve up caipirinhas, Brazil's national cocktail, while seafood restaurants dish out platefuls of freshly caught fare. Yet, amid all this lively activity, there's always room for tranquil moments, whether it's soaking up the sun or taking a leisurely swim in the azure waters. But it's when the sun sets that Copacabana truly comes alive. The beach's New Year's Eve celebrations are legendary, attracting millions from around the globe. As midnight approaches, the beach becomes a sea of white-clad revelers, with fireworks illuminating the night sky and samba music echoing across the waters. It's a spectacle that encapsulates the spirit of Rio, vibrant, passionate, and unashamedly joyous. In Copacabana, there's an activity for every kind of traveler. You can learn to surf with local instructors, take a bike ride along the promenade, or simply lay back and watch the world go by. It's a place where the city's hustle and bustle meets the tranquility of the sea. 
creating a unique blend of excitement and relaxation. Copacabana, with its golden sands and azure waters, is a testament to Rio's vibrant beach culture. It's a place where the pulse of the city meets the rhythm of the ocean, creating a symphony of experiences that's uniquely Rio. Leaving the beach behind, we ascend to another of Rio's iconic landmarks, Sugarloaf Mountain. Rising majestically from the edge of Guanabara Bay, this monolithic peak of quartz and granite is a spectacle that has been capturing the imaginations of travelers for centuries. To reach the summit, we embark on a thrilling journey by cable car. Originally constructed in the early 20th century, this mode of transport offers an adventure in its own right. As we glide upwards, the cityscape of Rio unfolds below us, revealing a panorama that is both breathtaking and humbling. From the top, the view is nothing short of spectacular. The city sprawls out beneath us, a vibrant patchwork of neighborhoods, beaches and forests, all framed by the shimmering blue of the bay. And there, standing sentinel over it all, is the iconic silhouette of Christ the Redeemer, a sight that never fails to inspire awe. But the mountain itself is more than just a vantage point. It's a testament to the power of nature, a geological marvel shaped by millions of years of erosion. Its unique rock formations, characterized by their rounded, bulbous shapes, are a sight to behold, their surfaces gleaming in the tropical sun. Sugarloaf Mountain is also steeped in history. It was here that the Portuguese first landed in the 16th century, forever changing the course of Brazil's destiny. And during World War II, it served as a strategic lookout point, its summit bristling with anti-aircraft guns. Today, it's a place of tranquility, a sanctuary above the bustle of the city where visitors can immerse themselves in the natural beauty of the landscape. Whether you're a thrill seeker, a history buff, or simply a lover of stunning views, Sugarloaf Mountain has something for everyone. With its impressive peaks and breathtaking views, Sugarloaf Mountain is a sight to behold. It's a place that captures the essence of Rio, its beauty, its history, and its spirit. So when you visit this remarkable city, make sure to take the time to ascend to the top. After all, the view from the summit isn't just a sight to see, it's an experience to remember. Stepping into the heart of Rio, we find ourselves in the vibrant neighborhood of Lapa, home to the famous Celeron Steps. This district, pulsating with life and energy, is a testament to Rio's dynamic spirit. Lapa, once a sleepy residential area, has undergone a spectacular transformation over the years. Today, it stands as a bustling hub of nightlife, where samba rhythms echo through the streets and the air is thick with the aroma of traditional Brazilian cuisine. Lapa's history is as rich as its culture. The neighborhood was an important locus during the 1950s Bossa Nova movement, a genre that reshaped Brazilian music. Even today, the echoes of that era can be felt in the vibrant music scene that fills the bars and clubs each night. At the heart of Lapa lies its most iconic landmark, the Celeron Steps. Named after the Chilean-born artist Jorge Celeron, these steps are a vibrant testament to one man's passion and dedication. Celeron began renovating the dilapidated steps in the early 1990s, covering them with over 2,000 pieces of colorful tiles, mirrors, and ceramics from around the world. His project, initially dismissed as a madman's obsession, gradually gained recognition and is today one of the most visited sites in Rio. The Celeron steps, with their riot of colors, are more than just a staircase. They're a canvas that tells a story of dedication, of vibrant creativity, and of a love for this city. Each tile, each fragment of mirror holds a piece of Celeron's heart, and each step you climb brings you closer to his vision. As you navigate these steps, you'll find yourself immersed in a world of color, reflecting the diverse culture and vibrant energy of Rio itself. The steps are not just a path, but a journey, a vibrant cascade of color that captures the essence of the city's spirit. Lapa, with its bohemian spirit and the striking Celeron steps, is the pulse of Rio's nightlife. From the rhythmic beats of samba to the colorful cascade of the Celeron steps, Lapa is a district that truly embodies the vivacious and dynamic spirit of Rio. From towering mountains to golden beaches, from iconic statues to colorful neighborhoods, Rio de Janeiro is a city that has it all. 
We've traversed the majestic heights of Christ the Redeemer, basked in the sun-kissed glory of Copacabana Beach, and marveled at the panoramic views from Sugarloaf Mountain. We've also immersed ourselves in the vibrant pulse of the Lapa neighborhood and climbed the eclectic Celeron steps. Each landmark, a testament to the city's diverse cultural tapestry and its spirited people. But these are just fragments of the rich mosaic that is Rio de Janeiro. Every corner of this city echoes with stories. Stories of history, tradition and life that are waiting to be discovered. So, pack your bags, strap on your adventurous spirit and dive headfirst into the captivating allure of Rio. So when are you planning your adventure to Rio de Janeiro? Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more travel guides and tips.